Hey guys, Kate Marie Saul here, back at you with the What Sold video. This is for week 43 of 2022. Starting out with not many sales at all. <laughs> One Facebook sale, uh, and then some Amazon sales. This Jelly Joyride cutie car, I probably paid like three or four bucks for it. Actually, I might have gotten this one clearance down to a dollar. I don't remember for sure. But it sold for 10 bucks plus shipping on Facebook. I had zero sales on eBay and zero sales on Mercari. Now I have two accepted offers that I accepted on eBay. One for a Carolina Panthers hat that sold for 130 and one for a Jelly Cat for 200 But neither one of those is paid yet, and I'm not confident they're going to pay because of the low feedback they had. But if those sell, I'll let you know <laughs> if they actually go through. Amazon sales. This little guy, Slippers, the bunny, sold for 16 plus ship. This Cars Fabulous Lightning McQueen sold for, I think, 25 on Amazon plus shipping. All of Amazon is always plus shipping. This Jimmy Buffett CD. I was able to sell it on Amazon. Usually I can't sell CDs, but for some reason it allowed me to sell this one. I've got like four more, so hopefully those will sell too. 10 bucks plus shipping. I paid a dollar clearance at Walgreens. Blaze, Squishmallow Clip, paid like six or seven, sold for I think 12 plus ship, so making a little bit of money there. And the best sale to start out the week. As always, Trusty Yoda, sold for 57.75 plus ship, paid originally 12.99 for it. So that's it for sales to start out the week. Hopefully they will get better, because last week was really good, and... Uh, I'm going to be listing a lot for the next couple days, so hopefully the sales will start flowing in. Here are my Tuesday sales. Let's start out with Amazon. Bubba for 99 plus shipping. As always, paid 16 at Walmart for him. Nestor the Owl for 7 plus ship. Paid 65 cents. R Roulette from Pokemon. Never seen this Pokemon. Uh, it's supposed to be one of the newer generation ones, but it sold for 18 plus ship. I paid 3 and then Sunny the Bumblebee sold for like 40 plus ship. I paid 11 last summer. Moving on to Facebook. One sale. This keyboard I got it at the Bro Bridge Citywide Garage sale. Sold for like 13 plus shipping on Facebook. Second eBay store. This Bite the Wax Tadpole <laughs> Illuminati card. Sold for like 4 bucks I think. This isn't one of the best ones, but I did sell some of these for over 90 bucks individual cards. Paid 40 cents for every, for all the cards. Wacky Racers. Uh, this is Mean Machine from Hanna-Barbera. It's a Funko Pop. One of the bigger Funko Pops. Funko Ride, I guess, technically speaking. Sold for 85 bucks. I think I paid, like, I don't know, if, I can't even remember where I got this. Maybe 20 bucks. 20 bucks maximum on this. Another eBay sale. Jacqueline Smith, this came out of a storage unit, it was new with tags, so that's why I listed it. Sold for 15, a free ship. A Poshmark sale, Wrangler shirt. Sold for like 15 plus ship on Posh. This is a Mercari sale. It's a Marshall Double XL jacket slash windbreaker, I guess. It's not very heavy, but sold for like 20 or 24. And then the best sale is the last eBay sale. This is free to me at this point. This little Lego manual, 10026, is the Naboo Starfighter. This is for the Ultimate Collector series. If you ever see Ultimate Collector series in Lego and Star Wars, you should pick it up. This sold for $60 for a manual. Yes, it's just the manual about how to put the thing together. I sold the actual uh, Naboo Starfighter for like 230 bucks, I think, sometime last year. I think it was last year. But yeah, 60 bucks for a manual. Really good. Here are my sales for today, starting out with Amazon. Two Amazon sales. Blaze, the Squishmallow Clip, for 13 plus ship, I paid seven. Gordon, for 50 bucks, paid like, I think I paid five for him at a garage sale, you'll see that in an upcoming video. But he sold for 50 bucks plus shipping, so this is seven and a half inch Gordon. He was a Walmart one, I think that's the only place you'd get him was Walmart. But yeah, 50 bucks for him. eBay sales, Frankenstein, Funko Pop. Paid like a dollar for this clearance at Walgreens. Sold for 34 bucks free ship. These tiny little Lego, if you can even see them, these are called Lego Baby. They are tiny, like maybe half an inch big. They sold for like 15 or 16 bucks free ship. Exploding Kittens, took a best offer of 12. I might make a little bit on that, but I'm not gonna make much. Facebook sale, Rubble Paw Patrol, sold for I think 10 plus ship on Facebook. Izzy on eBay. Free shipping, 18 bucks. Paid like six, so I'm probably gonna make five or six on that. Mercari Red She Hulk sold for, I think it sold for 32 on Mercari with free shipping. I originally paid 16 because of the exclusive sticker. 
And the other last sale is Poshmark. These freeze out. This came from the Harley Davidson uh, storage unit that is free to me. These are free to me at this point. They sold for, I think, 28 plus shipping on Poshmark. So good sales overall. Here are my Wednesday sales. Starting out with one tiny Amazon sale. It's the five inch Yoda Squishmallow. Sold for like 39 plus ship. I paid six. So that's a good profit there. Probably a good 25 or $30 profit <laughs> for a tiny little Yoda. Haven't sold one of these in a while, so I'm glad to see that one go. One Facebook sale, Department 56. I've had these for a while now, probably uh, five or six months. But this little outhouse Department 56 sold for 50 bucks plus shipping on Facebook. So glad Facebook's producing some more sales now. For a while, it was for like two or three weeks, it was dead with no Facebook sales at all. Sold Blockbuster Tupperware. Y'all remember me finding this? Oh, I guess I should actually show you. There you go. Blockbuster Tupperware, 30 plus shipping. Uh, I don't pick up too much Tupperware, but remember I saw Blockbuster on it, I had to pick it up. And like I said, I pay, I think I paid, actually paid up for that. I paid five bucks for that. Also on eBay, one or two more sales. This Strawberry Kittens, I think that's what this is. Yeah, Strawberry strawberry Kitties, Chattens, fra, fra, is it Phrase, Phrase, <laughs> I don't know how you say that word. This sold for like 11 with free shipping. Might make two or three bucks on it. Smoke Rise is a decent clothing brand. I think I got this out of a storage unit. I don't remember exactly, but it's distressed jeans. You can see that it's got a lot of holes in it, uh, but it's made that way. Or maybe not even holes. Maybe it's just dis designed that way. Either way, sold for like 25 free ship. This will fit in a flat rate padded envelope or some other form to ship it because it definitely weighs over a pound. The last sale, this little Pokey the Turtle. <laughs> This guy sold for 12 free ship. I probably paid 50 cents for him. And that's it for sales for today. Pre-weekend sales. Let's start out with Amazon. First up, another Jimmy Buffett CD. Sold for $9.99 plus shipping. I paid a dollar for that. Nemo Squishmallow sold for $49 plus shipping. I think I paid like six bucks for him. I think he was clearance down at one point at Walgreens. Tiny sold for $35 plus ship. Link Super Mario Brothers. I found this uh, somewhere. I don't even know. I think I sold it at one point. I got returned or something like that. But he sold for like 49 bucks for Mario Brothers plush. Cassie the squeeze mole sold for 12 plus ship. Bonnie from Night, uh, Five Nights at Freddy's sold for I think like 12 plus ship. I paid 275. The worst sale is this puzzle. I probably paid 9.99. It sold for like I don't know. Five bucks plus shipping. So I'm losing money before I even ship it out. But it's better than donating to the store because I think I'll clear like four bucks out of it. So at least I'll get something back. Whereas donating, I'd get zero. Now if I was going to get negative money, then yeah, I'd be better to donate it. But I'm still making a little or still getting back some of it. Illuminati cards. <laughs> this one is Law and Order. And this one is the Hand of Madness. This is the Illuminati card. Somebody bought three cards total. It's two of Law and Order one of the hand of madness so 17 bucks for those two these will ship out first class mercari gremlin sold for 14. he sold pretty fast jack paris exclusive beanie boo got this in hattiesburg mississippi one time for a dollar he sold for 37 free ship the last two sales are both facebook so facebook all of a sudden coming in strong these santa and friends snow globe train I bought this two weeks ago, I think, or three weeks ago now, at a citywide garage sale for like a dollar or fifty cents or something like that. And you can still see kind of the label was there. I think it was a dollar fifty for him. And he so this sold for fifteen plus shipping. The best sale, best pre weekend sale, is a heavy one. This saxophone. It's a Selmer alto sax. Let's see if I can show y'all. Can at least show y'all the big part of the sax this saxophone sold for 30 or i paid 35 it sold for 220 bucks plus shipping on facebook so that's really good isn't it <laughs> i'd say so i love selling musical instruments if i haven't said that before got to find a box to put it in i think i have one that it'll fit in it might be a little bit of a tight squeeze but you hear you hear that that's just the handle that saxophone's pretty secure in there so that's it for pre-weekend sales. Always good when you have a $200 sale. Here are my weekend sales, starting out with Amazon. Another Jimmy Buffett CD, Life on 
Life on the flip side. $9.99 plus shipping. Reginald Corgi Devil Dog for $32 plus ship. I paid $16. Paisley sold for like $17 plus ship. I think I paid $16, so I might lose a dollar or two on Paisley. Mercari Sales, my first Illuminati card I've sold on there. This is Blinded by Science. It's an Illuminati card. This one sold for $25 bucks on Mercari. So a good sale there. Had to take it off the second eBay store. I was hoping I still had it too. Bandai Gohan action figures. These sold for I think like 30 on Mercari. It's a little you put them together. Um, but it's two of the one complete one and then one that has pieces and parts. So $30 for both. Those are free to me at this point. This Hello Kitty, another ornament from Hello Kitty, sold for 24 bucks. Free to me free at, to me at this point. We got Flopsy. Paid like a dollar or two at Walmart clearance down, sold for 12 And then this cool Billy Cannon shirt. I almost kept this for myself. Uh, Billy Cannon, the first ever Heisman Trophy winner at LSU. This sold for like 15 Two Facebook sales. Epic golf club cover. This came from the 127 sale, sold for 16 This one sold for 9 These are both plus shipping on Facebook. So Facebook's always plus shipping. Most of these are free shipping. These are Am eBay sales. This little Furby sold, I think I got it uh, at a thrift store for like 50 cents. I'll show that thrift, thrift with me at some point. But yeah, this Furby paid 50 cents for it. Sold for $24.99. Not working. I t clearly put it in the listing. It doesn't work. So hopefully the buyer read that. I uh, put batteries in it and it didn't work. And I don't know how to troubleshoot uh, fixing a Furby. So <laughs> this Batman DVD Blu-ray sold for I think 35 Got this at a garage sale a while back for two bucks. This Woodstock sold for like 15. Paid 50 cents or so for that. Garchomp. <laughs> this is a Pokemon figure. Action figure. Got this at that garage sale where I got like Pokemon, Micro Machines, Transformers, Lego, everything. Paid probably, to me at this point, this one's free. I got it with a bunch of Pokemon cards as well. This one sold for 20. Free ship. Two Funko Pops. The Tick sold for $34.99. Free ship. Garandin sold for like 14 I think I paid 16 for Garandin and 16 for this one. Usually whenever they have the stickers like that, the convention stickers, they cost 15 plus ship. So definitely losing money on that one, obviously. This Marvel Legends, Yondu, sold for 10 Free shipping. This is an Amazon return, so it's free to me at this point in terms of accounting purposes. Carriages from Bocage. It's a really nice LSU uh, striped shirt, dress shirt. Sold for $34.99. And one of the better sales for the weekend, these Cole Haan shoes. I think I paid 2 bucks at a yard sale for these. They sold for $48 with free shipping. Shipping, I just printed out the label. It was about 12 bucks for these. So making a profit of probably $20 to $30, somewhere in that range for these shoes. And that's it for the weekend. Thanks for coming along. Don't forget to leave a like. Comment with your favorite sale. I don't even know what they what mine would be for this video. Maybe the Illuminati card just because it's fun to still be making profit from the 40 cent buy that I made a long time ago. If you ever want to look up the Illuminati cards, look up Cajun Reseller Illuminati cards. I paid 40 cents, made over $500 on those. And uh, subscribe if you're not subscribed. Thanks for watching.